Welcome to the art project. If you're new here, please subscribe. Uh, if you enjoy this video, please give me a thumbs up. It helps me out tremendously. Thank you for your support. Sorry I've been gone for so long, um, but today I'm going to just do a little ink painting of uh, a crow. So I got my sketchbook out. I covered up a page because I didn't want to get any uh, ink on it. And um, I put a little bit of paper behind uh, the other page so I didn't get any ink on the rest of the sketchbook. Uh, I started by priming the entire uh, page with a little acrylic paint, just some plain white acrylic paint. Really could have been any color, probably should have chosen black, uh, but I wasn't entirely sure what I was going to do. Uh, I just needed to get started. And if you've noticed, I haven't really produced any videos in a while. Um, and believe it or not, I haven't really been drawing or painting in a while. I've done a little bit here and there. I did a picture of a Tesla. If you saw the last video, I did a little painting of that. Um, the main reason is because I've been working so hard in my yard. I have built a fence. I have just created all kinds of stuff. Um, maybe I'll do a little tour of some of that stuff later if you are interested. If you are interested, let me know in the comments down below. Um, after I, after the white paint dried, I put some uh, black uh, FW ink on it. I spritzed it with a little alcohol, uh, wiped it off. I really am just kind of going for some texture. Um, the FW that I used was pearlescent black, but I really wanted a little bit more black black. So uh, I went with the Bombay black ink. And... Uh, I really think that the Bombay black ink is sort of acrylic based uh, too. Anyway, I spritzed it with a little uh, rubbing alcohol as well. Then I got some FW white, which is not very opaque. And I literally, without any preparatory drawing at all, started drawing this crow. I was looking at it on the internet. I literally took the first image that I saw. Uh, doing a search for crow and uh, I liked one I thought it was kind of perfect and uh, jumped right into it and like I said uh, I'm just doing this kind of like uh, freehand all I did was kind of go around the outside with white FW ink <clears throat> filling in the negative space and this is just the start of it and I think you'll see in a minute it, it turns out halfway decent maybe he looks a little bit like a chicken I don't know uh, it was a lot of fun just to throw down some paint again after so long I hope y'all have been using your quarantine um, to become either better artist or or just getting some stuff done around the house in the yard like I've been doing um, I don't want to go into that too much because I probably will make a video I hope to make a video of what I've been doing around my house and yard. So anyway, um, after everything dried, I went back with some white FW ink, which is acrylic based, I believe, and started um, filling in just a few details. And my details are sloppy. I'm not trying to recreate the exact crow that I see in the image on my laptop. I'm just trying to evoke the idea of the crow not trying to make a photographic image just just trying to invoke the idea of the crow i keep spritzing it with uh, a little rubbing alcohol that i've got in a spray bottle and i do that just to get some texture do you see that texture down there at the bottom it's pretty cool uh then i decided he needed a shadow at first i started going around the legs then i decided you know what i'll just go over the legs give him a little shadow on the ground <clears throat> and then uh, i wanted to bring the uh, white out a little bit more in order to make him uh, stand out better but uh, I was impatient and I wasn't waiting on the ink to dry like I should so it took me a couple of goes and then um, I inevitably just kind of painted out a lot of that texture back there but that's okay there's still a lot of texture in the bottom and there's some brush texture there in the top I've got this idea in my head about doing a whole journal of crow drawings and paintings. So 
if you think that's a good idea let me know in the comments down below um, also if you would like to contribute to that in any way uh, I need a new sketchbook to do it in I don't want to do it in my current sketchbook because I want the entire book to be crow a page of crows after another page of crows after another page of crows so on um, and I've got a couple of sketchbooks but I don't really want um, to use the ones that I've got because they're either like way too many pages or they're lined or something like that so anyway just throwing that out there if you want to support me you can send me a sketchbook that'd be awesome uh, really like the Stillman and Byrne uh, wet media sketchbooks those are great and I've started using the soft cover ones so if you're interested in the sketchbook that I use you can look down in the description there should be a link an Amazon link to the uh, sketchbook that I use anyway that's my crow uh, it was kind of fun I think I'll do another one tomorrow later go make some art